Like us, health is an important aspect of an animal's well-being. Think back to a time when you felt sick. You might have been uncomfortable or had little energy. Like us, animals feel discomfort when they are in pain or have poor health, which is an aspect of their well-being. If you fell down and hurt your arm, what would happen? You probably would go see an adult, and they would probably tell you to go see a doctor. When our animals get hurt, they need medical treatment just like us, but they need a specialized medical doctor that's for animals called a veterinarian. Veterinarians have special training that helps them determine what is causing pain in animals, which is a pretty hard job since animals can't tell them what hurts. Once they know what is causing the pain, they can treat the animal, helping them to feel better. There's more to health than just getting treated. Grooming and good hygiene are also important when it comes to your animal's overall happiness and health. Think about how important it is to brush your teeth every day and wash your hands after using the washroom. Doing so prevents you from getting painful cavities or from getting sick. Well, animals are like us too. They need proper hygiene and grooming in order to feel comfortable and healthy. For instance, cats often use a litter box for their bathroom. It is important to scoop the poop and pee every single day because cats don't really want to walk on their own waste. Remember when we talked about the importance of good nutrition? Washing your pet's food and water dishes is also an important part of good hygiene. Now let's talk about grooming. Horses need to be brushed often to remove dead hair and skin, otherwise they can develop painful skin conditions. In addition, they need to have their hooves trimmed regularly. If a horse's hooves are too long, the horse can have trouble walking and they may become injured as a result. Other animals also need to be groomed regularly. For instance, some long-haired dogs often need to visit the groomers to get their fur trimmed. Others need brushing. Cats also need brushing. Otherwise, their fur can become easily matted, which is painful or can cause skin issues. If you are unsure of how often you should be grooming your animal, make sure to check in with your veterinarian. Since animals are unable to communicate with us using words, it is important to pay special attention to them to make sure they are not in pain or unwell. These signs can be indicated through an animal's behavior. Like us, changes in appetite, like not eating as much, being more tired than usual, or becoming upset or aggressive may indicate that your animal is unwell or maybe in pain. Okay. That's why prevention is a key part of your animal's health. Just like how you need to go to your doctor, dentist, or optometrist, animals need checkups too. Going to an animal doctor or a veterinarian on a regular basis will keep your pet healthy. Veterinarians can find problems before they become troublesome. By catching the problems early, your pet has a better chance to stay healthy. You probably have gone to a health professional to get a vaccine. Just like humans, animals also need to get vaccines to prevent future illnesses. In fact, taking your pet to the veterinarian to get vaccinated is a very important part of being a responsible pet owner. Adequate nutrition is also an important part of an animal's health. We talked about why healthy food in the right amounts is important for us and animals. Eating too much or too little can have negative health consequences. Let's not forget about exercise. Think about how good it feels to go for a walk outside or play soccer with your friends after hours of trying to finish your homework. It's nice to finally stretch your legs and get your body moving. Not only is exercise good for our health, but it's good for animals as well. Like for us, exercise can help animals build muscle and keep their bones healthy. Therefore, it is important that exercise is a regular part of an animal's life. As responsible animal owners, it is our responsibility to make sure our animals are healthy and pain-free. If you have any concerns about your animal's health, make sure to contact your veterinarian. For discussion questions and activities, and to learn more about the needs of animals, visit everylivingthing.ca slash five needs.